guns and prayers, a man shows up to the Santa Fe High School, Texas, shooting with an American flag and a gun. Another man says, it's an embarrassment, pic.twitter.com slash texnerp, Scott McGrew, at Scott McGrew, May 18, 2018 As news continues to pour in about the deadly school shooting in Santa Fe, a Texas man raised eyebrows when he arrived on scene with an American flag and a pistol on his hip to make America great again. Sometime after an active shooter alert went out early Friday, what went through this man's head, he said, I was, get to the school, and, make America great again. When asked about his plan of action, he replied, offering support. A, God bless, Yaul, would go a long ways right now for a lot of people. Then he walked off. Another man being interviewed at the scene was enraged. We need prayers. This idiot is walking down the street with a damn pistol on his side where we just had kids get shot, he said. I'm a gun rights person. I have guns, okay. But this idiot is walking down here and saying he needs to make America great again. That's not what America needs. America needs prayers. We don't need this crap. This guy here is walking into a crime scene with a pistol and I hope they get him because this is a crime scene. This is an embarrassment, he added. Co reported that federal and county officials said there were multiple students killed and a wounded officer. The local news outlet also reported that there are at least eight dead. Harris County Sheriff Ed Gonzalez later said that the number killed is between eight and ten. Texas Governor Greg Abbott later confirmed that there were ten killed and ten wounded. The shooter, believed to be a student, has reportedly been arrested. Witnesses said the shooter had a shotgun. He has been identified as 17-year-old Demetrios Pajortzis. The Santa Fe Independent School District statement on the shooting, per NPR, this morning an incident occurred at the high school involving an active shooter. The situation is active but has been contained. There have been confirmed injuries. Details will be released as we receive updated information. Law enforcement will continue to secure the building and initiate all emergency management protocols to release and move students to another location. All other campuses are operating under their regular schedules. Image via Twitter.